Hello everyone. First thing I'm going to do is apologize for the lighting because um, it is 3.30 p.m. and it is getting dark outside. And this was the only time I was able to film this video. So it is what it is. I wonder, I wonder if I got my lamp in here, if that would make a difference. Ooh, we have a lighted moment. Okay, you guys. So this kind of works, I guess. Maybe it's better. Leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Today, you are not getting um, the Shake It Off with Angela. I think we're on week 10 or 11. I can't remember. We're not getting that today because I decided that I'm going to be recording that on Saturdays today. So today I'm going to be taking the day and recording that. Um, and then you guys will see that on Sunday. So that is like the little switcheroo from my channel. That is like a little update. But today, you guys, we are doing product empties. I have so many. By the way, you guys, I got this little Def Leopard sweatshirt moment, sweatshirt moment um, from Hellmart in the junior section. So this is an extra large, super cute. I got this one and a Colorado one just because... Colorado moments are the moments to be in um, for the winter time anyway. Anyway, so I have all of my products. It has been a minute since I have done an empties video to share with you guys. This is going to be beauty related, household related, food related, everything but candles. I do my candle videos separate for empties. By the way, also, if my voice gets a little hoarse, it's the end of the day and this is what we're doing. So this is going to be random. I've got my um, trash bag here. Here's my trash and let's get started. So uh, first thing I have is my Philosophy Shower Gel and this is in Fresh Cream and Mint. I used to hate the Fresh Cream fragrance for Philosophy, but when they paired it with the mint, I was like all for it. So that's what this, whoops. That's what this looks like here. And I loved it. And I, you guys, would definitely repurchase it again. Um, I also have from Bath and Body Works, this is Blue Skies and Blooms Hand Wash. And I loved this too. It was really good. And I would definitely repurchase again. This I do need to repurchase because I have been using this shit every single day for my tongue. I also got a tongue scraper, which is really, really nice. I've never had a tongue scraper before, you guys, but I do find that it like helps for coffee breath, halitosis, you know, whatever. But I have been using the Clean Mint Mouthwash. This is by um, Dentist Formulated Thera Breath is the name of it. And you can just pick this up anywhere, Hellmart, Walmart, well, Hellmart and Walmart are the same thing, Target, whatever, uh, Walgreens. But yeah, I really, really like this stuff. I like the blue uh, better than the pink and the green uh, flavoring. So if you've tried the green and the, and the pink and you don't like those, try that royal blue color. It's magnificent. Um, here we have some foodie items. I finished the Nans Pumpkin Spice Biscotti. I use these in my creamer when um, I, or my creamy, when I was making and still am making the ice cream. And this I got at Big Lots and it was amazing. Here we have some dog treats mixed into this. This is by Crazy Dog. And this is what I use for Rocky Rococo for his treats. They are like 1.5 calories a piece. So if your dog is trying to like watch their weight or whatever. These are really, really good. So each time he goes to the bathroom and when he comes back in, he gets a little treat and it's just like an incentive for him to make his poo-poo outside. I also finished by, um, oh, I got this at the new Sierra store. These are the lemon ginger little, like they're, they're classified as candies. They're little gummies, but they're like they're chewier than, oh, not chewier than gummies. They're a little bit harder than gummies. And with the colds and all the things that I've been having, I could load up as, on as much ginger as, you know, I possibly wanted to. And these were really good. I love the flavor. The ginger was strong. So it kind of like cut, you know, my runny nose and stuff like that. But 
These are in the um, flavor Zesty Lemon and they were $3.99 at the Sierra store. I also finished the Decaf Black Tea Stash. Um, this is the Chai Spice. Really, really good. My neighbor got this for me for when I was sick with pneumonia and I appreciate it because girl needed to have her tea at that moment. Um, I also finished some sunflower kernels. These were from Big Lots. Really, really good. Again, to put like on an English muffin, put some, you know, sunflower kernels on there with some cream cheese and you're good to go for your snack. I also finished the PB Fit peanut butter. This is a really good alternative to peanut butter if you're looking for something lower calorie. It's like half the calories of peanut butter, but it still tastes pretty good. I mean, it's not peanut butter, let's not lie, but it's pretty good. Okay, so now I'm gonna get this big honkin' container down so it's a little bit closer to me. And let me just reposition my trash here. Oh, I also finished by Victor Allen. I finished this caramel macchiato coffee. I get this from the Baker's Outlet in Kimberly and it is to die for. So um, if you live in the area, check that out. So here we go. This is gonna be kind of fast and furious. I finished the Nature's Bounty uh, Biotin little gummies. Oh my God, it just fell. Super good for people with thyroid conditions who are on thyroid medications. Our hair dries out, our nails get brittle, our skin gets dry, and biotin is the way to go for that. So that's really good. I also finished some of the pumpkin spice um, tea from Stash. Here we go. This is decaf, and that's what that looks like there. If we will focus, there we go, a little focus moment. Um, again, I got that from my neighbor, super, super nice. Here's some more dog treats in the taco flavor of the crazy dog uh, dog treats that we finished. More tea, spearmint flavor in the traditional medicines. Um, I actually picked this up from Amazon and yeah, we're, we're finished with it. Here's another one, chamomile. My neighbors got me this as well, finished that. We just had all the teas and all the lands. I also finished this crush. Um, this is the like flavored water things that you can get. I use this in my Ninja Creamy to flavor my vanilla ice cream bases. So this had orange, grape, and strawberry in it. So finish that. I also finished the Monday brand of the shampoo and conditioner. I got this at Target. This was the volume one. Now, my hair is getting thinner as I age, so I thought volume would be great. This really dried out my hair, and I didn't really like it. There's probably a fourth of this left in there, and I just, I didn't care for it. So maybe the moisturizing one would be better for me instead of the volume. I don't know. Leave a comment down below. Here we have Mrs. Meyer's all uh, multi-surface cleaning in the Acorn Spice. We love Mrs. Meyer's. We get it from Grove. I have an affiliated link commented down below in my description. Um, so if you use that affiliated link, you will get free Mrs. Meyer's products. Again, it's affiliated, so you don't have to. I also finished apple cinnamon tea. You guys, all the teas in all the lands. So good. Um, I also finished this e.l.f. Poreless uh, Face Primer. This stuff is really good, you guys. I use the pink one. I did get the hydration one, the blue one, and I don't really care for that. So when I'm finished with that one, I will definitely go back to the pink. I also finished by Griffin Soap. This is Lemon Verbena. Now, you guys, anything Lemon lemon Verbena reminds me of Laura Ingalls, um, Little House in the Prairie. Her teacher used Lemon Verbena um, perfume. So I don't know why it just reminds me of that. I also finished by Bath and Body Works Breathe Deep in the Eucalyptus and Lavender Shower Gel. Really nice especially when you have a cold. Um, here we have some heat protectant from Tressa May. I've been using this stuff for years and I absolutely love it. 
I also finished some Mrs. Meyers laundry. This is the lavender scent um, scent boosters. Little bit expensive, but I will say, oh my God, for my pajamas, you guys, or my sheets or my pillowcases, I love it. Just be a little bit careful. My daughter is allergic to this. She gets breakouts um, on her face when we use it on her sheets. So just be a little bit careful. I also finished Dr. Teal's foaming bath with the Epsom salt in lavender. This is the soothe and sleep. And I love that. Got that big lots. I also finished by Victor Allen. This is the pumpkin spice. Finished that one. So good. Okay, you guys, we're almost done. I finished the Fall in Love Vermont Maple Grove Coffee K-Cups. I got this at TJ Maxx. Oh my God, if I could find this in bulk, like in a big, huge box, I would buy it. This was so good. The brand is the brand called Fall in Love, manufactured by Paramount Roasters. Paramount Roasters. So I don't know. Ooh, my eye cream. This is the box, but I didn't finish it. You guys, my friend Randy suggested this for me for my under eye dark circles, and it works. I think you pronounce it Sarah Vive, but I'm not sure. It is the um, eye cream for the repair. And here, it says it reduces the look of dark circles and puffiness, and it works like a dream. I also finished um, Garnier Fructis. This is some shampoo. Eh, whatever. I finished uh, Head & Shoulders Green Apple. Sometimes in the winter and the fall, my scalp gets dry and I need to, you know, hydrate it and work on that. Uh, we finished Cactus Blossom. Cactus Blossom, if I can speak, in the um, hand soap. Really nice. I love the color of that. Method Body Energy Boost Shower Gel. This was a really nice one. A nice citrus, citrus uh, flavor. Also, Herbal Essence Shampoo in Rose Hips. Finished that. The CoverGirl uh, True Blend. My, my voice is starting to get super hoarse now. This is in L2, my shade. If you guys are wondering, love that. We'll continue to buy that. Outlast Secret Advanced Deodorant. It's really gross on top, so let's just stick it in the bag right away. Here we have some Garnier Fructis uh, Full Control Hairspray. This is not Full Control Hairspray. I hated it. It didn't hold my bangs well. I love spraying and making my bangs kind of like stay like this. Didn't hold it at all. Would not purchase it again. And we're almost done. We have some Dr. Teal's Pink Himalayan Salt uh, Bath Soak that I used. And Bio Oil. I was putting this on my upper eyelids because they were dry, but then someone told me not to use it, so I've just been using Vaseline. And here we have a lip balm from, who is this from, who is this from? Neutrogena Hydro Boost. It's, it's over, it's done with, I don't know. And the last thing are my organic sun-dried dates. If you guys put peanut butter on these and dip them in chocolate, you will be in heaven. And I got these from Costco. <sighs> so, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching my trash. And I will see you guys all later for another video. God bless and have a great day. Bye, everyone.